We've analysed more than 5,000 contracts across 400 different public bodies. Within them, we find multiple corruption red flags in more than £15 billion worth of contracts. That's almost one in every three pounds the British government spent in its COVID-19 response. We find a system that was beset with systemic weaknesses, political choices that enabled cronyism to thrive, and all enabled by woefully inadequate public transparency. We put in place a new way of doing it so that rather than individual contracts being agreed, as would be normal with the scrutiny that would come from that, HMT gave to the Department of Health a budget that it could spend. It raised that budget, I think, five different times. It ended up being close to £14 billion in the end, so that there would be no blocks and there would be speed of approval so that people could get uh, to the people who needed it.